What's up YouTube, it's your boy Carvin Ridge, and welcome back to another video. And in today's video, we're gonna be talking about do I plan on tuning my Infinity Q50? So definitely stay tuned. I got a lot to say about um, tuning this car. Am I gonna tune it this year or do I even plan on tuning it? So let's go ahead and get into the video. As you guys know, recently um, I did a ride along uh, with my boy Churro, he has the G37. I don't know if you guys watched that video, but if you haven't watched it, go ahead and watch it. Very, very, very entertaining. Um, and it was very, very fun. Now, my first initial plan was no, I do not plan on tuning this car at all this year. Um, just the fact that I felt like it would have been a waste of money for me to tune it as is right now, because like I said, my plan is to supercharge this car you know what i'm saying um i want to supercharge it you know i want to boost it and i was going to do everything all at once instead of you know doing a tune here and then doing another tune so i wanted to just do everything all at once but i'm not gonna lie after riding in that car it made me realize that a tune is actually really worth it <laughs> it was so fun i ain't even gonna lie like that was literally the most fun that i had in a while so shout out to my boy for uh, taking me on a ride um, in his whip. But to be honest, how the way I feel about it now is I'm not against it, but I still want to, you know, do my cosmetic stuff first. I'm not even going to lie. I'm very stern on that this year um, as far as, you know, Q50 is cosmetics. If it's in the budget, I wouldn't mind getting it tuned, to be honest, um, if it's in the budget. But I really wanna focus on, you know, like I said, cosmetics. I need tint done, cause I can barely see at night. I need um, I need the wheels to get cleaned up, cause I got a lot of curb rash on it and it kinda make the car look a little dusty. Um, I got a dent in the back that bothers the heck out of me. And it's so much carbon fiber pieces that you can buy for this car, just so much exterior mods that you can buy for this car that i really want to go full in on the cosmetics this year but like i said i'm not against it because i did buy the afe uh drop in so you guys will be seeing that very 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 soon uh probably once probably most likely when i get the cats on i'm gonna go ahead and put the drop ins in so you know we got pretty much the whole car complete most likely you guys know me i'm, I'm probably gonna most likely put the vibra resonators on here as well um, because I believe this car is straight pipe. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and add the fiber resonators and we're gonna see if, you know, I could possibly just tune it like that if I can. Um, I don't wanna go too crazy because like I said, I don't wanna get intakes. I don't wanna do that. I don't wanna do none of that because I wanna supercharge this car. That is the plan. I wanna supercharge this car. And I, I, like I said, I feel like that's just be wasting money just for instant gratification. What I wanna do is like I said, I just really wanna focus on cosmetics, but if it's in a plan, I mean, if it's if, if it's in a budget this year that we can squeeze out, um, I believe my boy Trill told me 950. We could go ahead and squeeze that out. And if my car is tunable, how the way it is, then cool. But if it's not, then it is what it is. But I'm not even gonna lie. Some things do scare me with a tune. You know what I'm saying? Um, I get mixed reviews about them. Some people say, you know, it's good. You know, they haven't experienced problems and some people experience lots of problems. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And um, that's one thing that really does scare me about a tune is that I just don't want nothing to go wrong, to be honest. Like, um, I like to keep my cars running in, you know, nice tip top shape, as you guys can see on my channel. like preach maintenance a lot of stuff like that and, and i just don't want nothing going wrong and uh i feel like y'all can't fault me on that because i never had done it before you know what i'm saying but um go ahead and leave a comment and let me know if you tune uh how long you've been tuned um how's your car running and all different stuff like that you know i really want to know i'm really interested in seeing those comments because um you know it it it, it does scare me a little bit you know what i'm saying because like I said, I never done it before, and I like my car running in you know tip top shape. I don't, I don't want to experience problems to where I'm forking out way more money than what I have to. You know what I'm saying? So let me know. And um, also let me know. Um, I feel like it is worth it after me driving in Charles G37. Um, it was a lot of fun, and I actually got one lined up 
possibly tomorrow so um you guys will be seeing that video very very soon i definitely feel like it's worth it it's just that i just don't want to break down he has 202,000 miles on his car and he said it's his daily and nothing ever happened and he got tuned by admin and he vouched by admin but a lot of people say you know different things you know what i'm saying some people be like well admin is this or the best tuner is this i don't know you know what i'm saying let me know in the comments though what tuner is the best uh about you know acknowledge me more about tunes because like i said i never i never like to come on this platform and act like i know everything or if i don't know everything i like to ask you guys for help you know especially when it comes to tuning because like i never did it before um I, I would like to do a dyno tune i don't want to do the remote tune i would like to do a dyno tune so you know it's done you know so he can whoever whoever tunes this car you know they can just tune it right then and there and i could leave and go about my day <laughs> like i don't want all the unnecessary stuff so um yeah so please enlighten me y'all let me know um you know your experience with your tune and how long you had it do you daily drive the car and all that good stuff let me know i'm tired of all these rock chips hitting my car man it's so annoying <laughs> but yeah that's really my thoughts on uh tuning my car my q50 um like i said it's, it's really uncertain but i'm not against it it's just that i would really like to do my cosmetic stuff first you know like i plan on doing i don't really too much care for the performance stuff this year just want this car to look good because uh, in the summertime i would like to pop out a little bit or you know towards the end of summertime i would like to pop out you know what i'm saying go outside you know and uh get some turn heads and stuff like that and um that's important to me you know that's what i want to do with my build um other people got you know other ideas of what they want to do but what i want to do is i want to do cosmetics first that's just what i want to do you know some people may want to um you know do performance first and that's okay do whatever you want to do like i um explained um in a few videos back whatever you want to do with your car do it but don't fault nobody else for doing what they want to do because at the end of the day that's their car not yours you know what i'm saying so if someone want to do this you can't be like oh no nah, don't do that do this you know what i'm saying nah it's their car let them do what they want to do just like you did with your own car you did performance first cool you did performance first somebody want to do cosmetic stuff first cool they did cosmetic stuff first or someone want to do maintenance first they want to do maintenance first so you can't fault for you know whatever someone wants to do with their car because it's their car it's not your car and um yeah you know i just wanted to get that message out for you know all you guys and let you know you know just do you at the end of the day do you um, have fun with your build and, um, and yeah, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. But like I said, please let me know in the comments about your tune. Um, let me know how you guys like it. You know, is it reliable? Um, all of that. Very interested, um, to read you guys comments and learning a lot of stuff about this tune stuff, but hope you guys enjoy it. And until the next video, peace.